Welcome to the Barbara Sports Stadium here in Kumasi. And of course, we're in for a big fixture that will be much of a flair in football. Kumasi Asante, Kotoko, and Techiman City. And the fans will be looking ahead to the resurgent rounds of Kumasi Asante, Kotoko, five games, and they have won four of those games and just picked up a defeat to our stars in midweek and Tishiman City picking up a drone game with Ashanti Gold so they come in with a lot of uh, energy a lot of strength and this is the first time actually they're playing Kumasi Frick is sent in as a handball and can actually take full advantage to get his fifth Ash Gold had one and Mohamed Dauda missed it oh, terribly it's Dauda Mohamed for Kumasi Asante Kotoko can he take advantage? And this time, he scores five goals for Kumasi Asante Kodoko. And simply, the Pokipan Warriors can't afford to smile here. You know, the last time they played against Itala, I see it was a penalty that gave them the three points. It was Amos Fripo who scored. This time, there's a young man, Dauda Mohamed, who is giving Asante Kodoko a lead on 20 minutes. Sublimely taking goalkeeper Rich Monai sent the wrong way and it was planted firmly on the ground by Dada Mohamed. Good for his confidence, a rising star, and this will take him really far. Well, the talking point for... Beyond Tichman City, the ball floated inside. Another powerful header from Isaac Ma, and on the left. Well, Koroko, two goal up here, down. Something to dent his confidence. This was the back pass, and look at Aye. Ayi is shot straight to Dada Mohamed, who finished back pass wasn't the best, and it was miss kicked. He profited from that error, and then shot home coolly there with goalkeeper Richmond Ayi completely beaten. Goal number six for the young man, and in, in a spate of time. Coach Ogdambao blocks. Was, and a save, brilliant. Sensational save there from Richmond Ayi, red one. Uh, this was the attempt that was shot in and look at how he tipped it over the frame the young goalkeeper doing very well at least to reduce in our way because then so i would definitely have to push this one out for a corner kick lovely kick and Tishman city obviously know that they still have a game and there you have it you know, I, I, Muhammad, uh, you know I love the composure of nsoa you know, he's keeping his composure, but it, that was a lovely one there from Baba Eric Donko. And Tishman City can take full advantage. Baba Mahama. Oh, lovely here from this young man. And a diving header there from Steven Menu. Wow. And again, <laughs> Tishman City simply can't get the ball in, and coach himself knows it. Uh, that I love, I love his exclamation, but excellent tricky there from. Baba Mahama, the match talked about Mahama and the ball to the far side. In Japan, it? just couldn't direct it inside. It looked like a gaping net. It was powerful delivery from Mahama. And there's the second time if it is a Japan, he scored 20 goals. There's still no substitutions. Uh, so the only change that has come in is Ohini Brenya, who has come to substitute Ahmed Adams who picked up injury in the first half Evan Squire going to ground to save uh, clear the ball away from Steven Menu and now Richmond Ayi also giving the ball to Dada Mohamed as Kodoko inside the box can they have a third they have guess what it's the man on a hat-trick Dada Mohamed oh, seven goals and he's still going the brilliant play there from the young star that's why he's so Highly rate to score in the Premier League, 16 years, and this is Dauda again. Perfect finish, cool finish there from the man. You know, just like a sniper, he doesn't miss his target. He controlled well, and then with his weaker left foot, he shot to the far side. With goalkeeper, are you completely beaten? That is depending on how it is struck. A header, and they get a goal back. Tishman City, they're not giving out Archie Sapong yeah, and have always <laughs> said that Kumasi Asante Kodoko and Archie Sapong does exactly that. You know, look at how it was well flighted from Baba Mahama once again, expert delivery and the header, very, very blistering and powerful.
goalkeeper Eresua. Yeah, free kick set in. Another header. Oh, the fourth goal has been registered for Kumasi Asante Koroko. Two four from points first goal for the Pokipan Warriors. And guess what? <laughs> what was the minute? You know, just when we thought, you know, they were on the verge of revival. They've been knocked off their perch again. Already they are down, but this will be the real killer punch there. That was two four from Paul. Out jumped Zakaria Isaku to head home. The fourth goal for the Porcupine Warriors. Oh, good goal there from Kotoko. And once again, they've... Two changes made by Kotoko. Is Emineza and a huge clearance comes in for Moini Brenya. Baba Mahama shafts the ball pretty well, looking for space. And Menu. Ah, oh, it's the a goal. The flag, the flag stayed, stayed down. down. And that'll be a major talking point. It looks like Kevin is in Japan. You know, did not waste time at all. You know, to slam in this goal. Was he offside? This was it. Oh, clearly in an offside position. And the assistant won. You know, could not spot it, but well taken. Play. For his ball! And just across the face of goal, Benetto Fori. Even as a fairy, they killed that one, but couldn't find target. But they're still not giving up. It's Benetto Fori. Benetto Fori. Oh, lovely save, Rich Monai. On his wicker foot, Benetto Fori. He was looking to score, but Rich Monai had different ideas and he stood to the test. You know, exactly when they were at Wapa last week, it was a similar thing. Look at the shot. Well saved. He was quick off his line. Maybe afraid should have lobbed the ball over and above the goalkeeper. He decided to go for a powerful shot, and that was pounded back into play by Premier League on a high note. But they end the first round on a very exciting note. Kumasi Asante Kodoko. Well, Four brilliant is. goals. Hat trick for Dauda Mohamed. And of course. Edwin, two four three points scoring, but the man who is seen as the man leading the team, Techiman City, obviously would not be disappointed in his goalkeeper, Richmond Ai. He gifted Dauda Mohamed a goal, but uh, Archie Sapong and Ebenezer Japong eventually had to score the two goals for Techiman City. The first round of the Premier League ending, second round starting on the 26th of June 2016. But for the fans of Kodoko, they would definitely be singing and dancing into the night because they have done an incredible job exactly. to support the team there. It ended in Kumasi. Kumasi Asante, Koroko 4, Techiman City 2.